Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and uh, welcome to the Franchise Hour, episode 12 of the season four. And it is my pleasure having two ladies as my guests today who are both pioneers in the milk tea business. Uh, so I'm happy to uh, introduce to you today uh, Miss uh, Joyce Koyu. She is the owner of True Blends. And Miss uh, Anne Oliveros. She is the Oliveros. She is the owner of uh, Selfie. All right. Uh, both concepts, while now there are so many uh, multi brands out there. Uh, but these two ladies were one of the pioneers. So Joyce and Anne, welcome to the Franchise Hour. <coughs> and, Hi, uh, Arty. Hi, Anne. Thank you for Hi. having us, Sir Arty. All yes. right. It's so, to be here today, sir. Uh, it's my pleasure having you both of you. Uh, I had you once both already, but then we had an issue with the internet of uh, Miss Joyce. And also, Anne had an issue with the video, so I thought I'd repeat the whole thing and uh, invite the ladies back, both together again, because both of them are pioneers in their own sense. All right. Uh, we call this episode the Milk Tea Pioneers because both of you guests started when Milk Tea was actually not yet as popular as it is today. So that's why, and I will ask you both the same questions. But first of all, before you went into the milk tea business, what actually were you doing before choice? Um, actually, sir, um, it was actually uh, I am a registered medical technologist by profession. Um, it was really actually a dream to open a diagnostic laboratory and not a, a not a, and not a cafe. Um, so since I graduated um, and took the board exam, um, you know I did. Actually, I wanted also to become a doctor, but there was a point in life that, you know, I had to choose, to choose from uh, a professional career or just to help my mom in our own business. Um, it was this day, actually, that my dad um, had a um, heart attack that let me decide to just um, help my mom in our family business. We are supplying um, school supplies and other stuff in um, one of the biggest uh, bookstores in the country and also in um, Binondo. Um, so, um, yeah, and there, um, so, well, um, it was a point that I had really to decide. So I just decided to help my mom. Then, um, one day there's the, but there's, um, usually a drama in life, um, which I can't forget. So she just told me when I was helping her, she just told me that she doesn't need me there. Um, after I resigned and everything. So then she just told me that, that I don't need you here. So I had to start my own business. Then... Um, maybe because of this certain drama in life, um, it made me realize, and um, I think it made um, or or it made me a stronger person because that was a time when I was like penniless. Imagine I worked for a few years only as a junior medical technologist in the um in a private hospital. So, um, I had to borrow money to start my own business, diba? So, that moment. That moment, whatever um, so group friends and um, referrals would uh, ask products from me, I would actually um, use my network to to find connections. And then that was the time when I started to um, to open my own business. I started with um, actually um, not in school supplies, but um, uh, by selling T-shirts, the printed shirts in universities and other schools. So at that certain moment, it made me realize that I had to start my own business when I entered this specific school in Quezon City. When I saw the market, um, I I thought, parang abi ko, but there's no there's no food cart yet at that time. Nang nang like nang nang parang um coffee shop like Starbucks like coffee bean and tea. There, so I decided to open uh, my own food cart business. So that was the time when I searched for suppliers and others. Um, so that is when <laughs> I started my own food um, um, coffee shop in a cart. 
Um, so a little fast forward when I was able to open my first branch in um, 2008 and then 2009 for the second branch. Um, it was when my brother went to Beijing in China to study Mandarin. Then he gave me the idea of putting up um, a milk tea store in the country since there's no milk tea stores yet. So since I have that coffee shop already in that um, certain school, um, we had the R&D, we had the research and development for the milk tea. So we, we played around with the tea concept with our ingredients of coffee. And then um, at first, of course, the, 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 the market wouldn't accept it yet because they didn't know it yet. But um, so, so what we did, we gave as in free drinks for everybody to try. Um, luckily, they accepted the, man, the the pearl milk tea and the taro. These are the two flavors that we introduced. And everybody accepted it naman, and people were actually looking for it. So there, so that's how we started the, the coffee and milk tea business. And what about in your case, uh, and, and what did you do before you started Selfie? And then also tell us your, your startup. Yeah, so when we started this um, Selfie, I mean, before I just graduated from college, and um, me and my cousin, actually, she's my partner, Ms. Jessa, and we went to Singapore to, to find a job there. And fortunately, um what we found there is um this um this concept of coffee wherein you put your selfie on it and then we said that why don't we bring this to the philippines and then um we were supposed to to work there but what happened is much more greater because we went in the we went back to the philippines and then we started this business um we really do not have the so it was a passion project for us and then um everything just felt just fall into place and um we started with one cafe at first and then people love our um concept and then that's when um, people started to ask um are you are you open for franchising and that's when we uh decided to um, go to Sir RK and ask for help about it. Basically, that's um, that's how we started. <laughs> uh, my follow-up question to that one, and was when did you actually start the self tea? When was that? Um, actually, it was 2017 when we started self tea, and then um, fast forward to 2018, we we are already open for franchising, and then from there up to now, we already have. 31 branches. <laughs> uh, Joyce, when did you start? Uh, we started franchising 2012, but we stopped franchising during 2016 to 2018, if I'm not mistaken. But you, you started the, the business itself. 20, 2009. 2008, 2009. 2009 sir. Yeah. So we're already 12 years old. Yes. We are quite quite long, quite long for uh, in the business of, of the milk tea. That's why I gave you the title of uh, being a being a pioneer. Uh, what do you think differentiates you from your competition? And um, basically, our concept itself is um, you put your selfie on milk tea. So we are first in the Philippines with edible selfie on milk tea on top. So at first, um, our com um, our comp during that time when we started, um, it's um, people are not used to having cream on top. Eh. It was only um, when Macau went here in the Philippines, um, dun lang naging popular yung um, cream cheese on milk tea. So um, during that time, we were the one who started it first, and then um, we're in you put your selfie on that milk tea. So basically, that's our um, main edge and unique. It's the uniqueness of our concept that made us unique from um, competitors. And the same question to you, Joyce. What what uh, differentiates you uh, and true plans from the rest of the milk tea shops? 
this had been a very challenging part for us, sir, because before when um when we started, we were the only ones who had the cheese cloud see the, the cheese cloud series on top and the milk teas with ice cream. But everybody copies, you know, as as time passed by, everybody would just have the same thing. But um to differentiate our products from others, maybe who um for me, we only we are the pioneer in the milk tea and the coffee concept. And at the same time, for our chicken chops, um, and that is what um, differentiates us from the others. Aside from the fact that our drinks are, um, when you taste it, it's really um, from the quality ingredients. You can really taste, you know, the the tea. Sometimes our clients would say that um, ito yung milk tea na hindi lang creamy, but with a kick. That is what usually um, they tell. Uh, that that is what usually they tell us. Uh, Anne told us they have thirty one stores so far. How many? Uh, true blends are out there. Uh, right now we have like 25, 25 only and um, resellers. Okay. But it's a nice number also already. Uh, we, we are now 18, 18 months in the, in the pandemic. And my question to you ladies is, uh, what changed for you in the 18 months operation-wise? And how did you pivot your uh, business? Uh, Joyce, you, you go first. Okay. Um, ever since pandemic, sir, you know, um, when it started, it's like everything was shut down. Like um, everything stopped for us. Like um, honestly, 2020, when 2020 entered, we were able to close uh, master, franchise, master franchises. But yun nga, we had to stop it. Eh. Even if we have their checks and everything, we have to stop everything. We have to stop um, opening. We were like... Um, we were ready to open like 10 branches that year. Same with Shops to Go. Um, but everything stopped. So what we did to pivot, um, we had to, to, to transfer everything online from all the physical stores for Manila branches. Um, we had to do it online. So instead of um, selling physically, we do, um, we do marketing online. So instead of me going to the stores physically also, I had to stay in the office. So um, I, I parang, para akong call center actually um i have to answer all questions for those who have um orders i have to pass all the orders to the branches especially pag may mga naliligaw na, na, na inquiries um on our facebook pages um aside from that instead of uh, aside from the franchising we entered into reselling so we opened uh true blends to resellers um especially to uh to those um home uh what do you call this especially to those um, uh, staying at home moms, um, you know, they would just get their orders through Viber, through Facebook, and then we would just deliver. At least, um, at the same time, we could also help them. And uh, for Anne? Yeah, so basically, experience. Yeah, so basically, same with Miss Joyce, no? So we transition into um, digital marketing, more, more on that. And of course, um, the major thing that we did all as well is um, upon adapting to the new normal. So we started to um, to have more partners in deliveries like Food Panda, Grab Food, and Lala Food. So that's basically how we are surviving. And um, Fortunately, um, there's a lot of um, bulk orders. We're receiving um, more on bulk orders because now of online. So we started to like market through um, corporate, corporate corporations and then um, meetings, events. So that's how we are doing right now. So um, even though um, some of our um, branches are closed and not operating, still we get to um, receive a lot of bulk orders naman because of um, uh, the way we market right now, um, self the end. Of, and we also were able to open another concept, which is Samgyup Express. So um, it complements the self tea. So um, yeah, that's it. We, we do bulk orders and we focus on digital marketing. And partnered with influencers and celebrities as well. So what do you think will be uh, the expansion plans of your uh, franchise and, and the company in the next years? Yeah, so we are still continuously um, offering franchise for selfie. And right now we have our new brand now, which is Samgyup Express. So 
what we are doing is um, since there's a lot of milk tea businesses na, so it complements each other. So when we do franchising, it's two in one na. All right. Uh, we'll uh, see your presentation later. And the same question goes to Ms. Joyce. Uh, what's your expansion programs for the next years to come? Okay. Um, right now, sir, we're still continuing to offer the, the franchise packages of True Blend. And at the same time, we are now offering the Capit Pinoy franchise package, which, uh, which starts at 88000 only. Um, so whoever wants to franchise at the comfort of their homes, they can already start their own businesses. And um, aside from that, we're also uh, opening True Blends for resellers. And um, as, uh, same with Miss Anne, we also have another brand. Uh, another brand It's called uh, Chops to Go, which also complements the milk business of true blends and um that's it excellent all right so let's take a look at your at your franchise uh offer and i put your slides in the screen choice and kindly make your presentation okay um, so there. Hi guys. Good day. Uh, good day, everyone. Um, so before anything else, I want to say thank you again to Sir RK um, for having me here again. Um, welcome everyone to Asia True Blends Franchising Inc. Again, I am Joyce Koyu, founder and CEO of Asia True Blends Franchising Inc. I'm a registered medical technologist by profession, but turned entrepreneur. Um, and the brands we have are the following. We have True Blends Tea and Coffee. We have Chops to Go and Tech Bytes Information Technology Solutions. I am here to present the franchise opportunities of uh, True Blends, which is, which is, of course, a proud member of the Filipino International Franchise Association. Uh, I am one of the founding incorpor incorporators and trustees of International Council for Small Business Philippines. And, as, um, and I am also the past president of the Association of the Filipino Franchisers, Inc. Um, this was my last project before I ended my term, the 17th Filipino Franchise and Business Expo at the World Trade Center in Manila. Um, this is in partnership um, with DTI, uh, Go Negosyo, Security Bank, and Globe. We, we were able to create more than 400 uh, franchise businesses from the show. And of course, I'm truly grateful to Sir RK that he supported this project, wherein he brought in FIFA members to join. I am an honorary member of Dugong Alay, Dugtong Buhay, which advocates um, bloodletting activities for clean and free blood for everyone. Um, we made this activity our social, uh, corporate social responsibility project, not just for True Bloods and Chops to Go, but as the association CSR project during my term in 2018. Um, this is very essential, especially at this time of pandemic. All these are in partnership with Congressman Alan Reyes of District 3 and Dugong Alay Dugtong Buhay. Uh, until now, we are doing this project and hopefully FIFA can join us too in this advocacy. Okay, so True Blend started brewing back in, 24, uh, in July 24, 2009 at the home grounds of the Ateneo Blue Eaglets. We started as a small cafe shop and offered coffee and milk tea beverages to the young Athenian students, parents, faculty, and staff. So Sir Rudolf, our, uh, Sir Rudolf Kotick developed our franchise system in 2012. And if I'm not mistaken, uh, I'm not sure if it's 2012 or 2011. But anyways, due to personal reasons, we had to stop for the franchising for some, uh, for some time around 2016 to 2018. 2018. Um, but we are now aggressively expanding nationwide. So far, True Blends has branches as far as Cebu and Cotabato, and, and we are looking for more business partners right now. Our mission is to produce and serve people of all ages in their craving for delicious, healthy coffee and tea blends at affordable yet high-quality beverages. True Blends won't disappoint. Our service is to give top-notch products with quality service to all customers, which is an important role in each and every one at True Blends. We don't camouflage our concept to hide the quality. We also don't use artificial flavoring nor powders. This is why you can really taste the difference with our coffee and milk tea blends. Our milk tea blends, as they say, is not just creamy, but ito yung milk tea na may kick. And this is our unique selling proposition. As our consultants and mentors would often tell us, we are the pioneer in this coffee and tea industry. 
Trueblend envisions to gain and attain customer trust and loyalty not only by offering our clients different kind of refreshments, but by giving our best in providing quality products and exceptional services. And by this, it is our vision to be in the line of our, of our country's most top successful and patronized shops. In 2013, we were featured in Entrepreneur Magazine as the first and leading milk tea and coffee shop in the country. New product lines were introduced over the time with approval of our loyal customers. After the, all the tedious effort of our trusted research and development team, we are proud um, to offer that our new set of product lines with a wider variety and more delicious treat, not just for youngsters, but also for the young at heart. New product lines were introduced over the time with the approval of our clients, like the Cheese Cloud series, the Taro Taro Milty, among the others. And these had been the curiosity of many ever since we launched them. Thus, this led us into franchising and got me to find Sir RK to learn more about franchising. So since the lockdown, we introduced our DIY milk tea, milk tea in liters and in gallons, so families can enjoy this flavor and fun in every brew experience at the comfort of their homes. We also introduced the frozen chicken chops of True Blends and Chops to Go during the quarantine. Our experiences throughout the years molded our institution and capabilities to comprehend our customers' taste and satisfaction. True Blends was the Food Franchise of the Year finalist in Asia Leaders Award in 2019, together with Rai Rai Ken. And with me here in the photo are the finalists in different categories. President Eric Kaig of International Council for Small Business and CEO of founder and founder of Philippine Retail Academy, Mr. RJ Ledesma of Mercato Central, Mr. Gerald Santos of Mr. Freeze, Mr. Joey Garcia of Rai Rai Ken, and Mr. Lansan of JCI Makati. And it was such an honor to be standing with these gentlemen. Trublands aspires to be globally competitive, just like these Ateneo athletes, and hope to be known as not just an ordinary cafe shop, but with a heart. These are some of our photos with our loyal clients. Here with Mr. Kiefer Ravenna, Ms. Gretchen Ho, Mr. Mike and Matt Nieto, uh, Kobe Paras, Ms. Eliza Valdez, among others. And also Ms. Dayan Medina, Ms. Nuki Serena, and Mr. Santiago also posted their comments in their, um, uh, on their social uh, media platforms. These are some of the, uh, of the looks of our stores, from cart to small, uh, to stall and store concepts. We have available uh, franchise packages to suit your budget. We have the cart, the stall, and the store packages depending on the preferred size and location. So for the cart category, with the franchise contract of three years, all you need to do is just look for a good location and trusted employees, and we will prepare everything for you. And we will also train your staff until your grand opening. And then for the stall category with the franchise contract of four years, this comes in 395,000 package. You may sell um, all drinks from milk tea to coffee blends for the stall um, um, until the uh, from the hot to ice to blended drinks. Plus, you may also sell our chicken chops together with other snacks. For the store category, you will be needing at least um, 60 square meters, and this is um, the and the contract franchise is of um, five years. This package uh, comes in uh, 495,000. Here, um, we are very honored to be visited by um, Cotabato Mayor Cynthia Gianni Sayadi during our um, ribbon cutting and grand opening in 2009 in uh, Cotabato. So for the store package, you may sell all drinks from milk tea to, to coffee, plus the wide variety of our food items from all day breakfast to rice meals to pasta and sandwiches, everything. <laughs> anyway, so for all the business partners and franchises and soon to be partners, these are our bonuses for everyone. So aside from the regular offers of our stores, they can also sell the products of milk, uh, of True Blends Frozen Depot. All they have to do is just provide an additional chest-type freezer. So another bonus for all uh, franchises and partners is that they can also set up their pop-up booths during events and they can also deliver by bulks. 
Um, and these are all free of charge. And of course, these are additional income for our franchisees and partners. And another bonus, we have a collaboration with the other brands like Potato Corner, um, Tokyo Tempura, Fiorinos, and Hair Cutters. So whoever, whoever franchises True Blends can get any of these brands for a very discounted franchise package. So we are doing this like two-in-one um, um, franchise. And we also are doing um, our three-in-one franchise package with um, Potato Corner and Fiorinos. And we'll be releasing that very, very soon. Um, this is an example of how the store would look like for a cola. Um, and um, we are very lucky and honored um, because uh, Miss Nadine Lustre will be opening her own um, True Blends and Potato Corner soon. So for those naman who, uh, who have very limited budget uh, but, are, but are very eager to start a business, we are offering this Capit Pinoy franchise package, which, only, uh, which is only 88000 um, these are best for small communities like villages and subdivisions. And you know, um, for the marketing, you, you just have you just need a cell phone to market all your products on Facebook, Viber, and other platforms. So for those who are interested, you may contact us through our mobile number 0960-854-9316 and look for our franchise operations manager, Mr. Julius Boridas. Or you can email us at trueblendsfranchising at gmail.com. Or you can actually PM us on our Facebook page um, or, so, uh, or on Instagram. Thank you guys for listening and thank you very much, Sir RK, for all the love and support for True Blends Tea and Coffee. Sir, you're on mute. <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> thank you for your presentation and... Uh... Of course, we we always here for for our partners. So let's bring in Anne again. Welcome back, Anne. And Hi. kindly, let's do your presentation. And I'm loading up your. I uh, put you on the stream, and uh, uh, and go ahead and make your presentation about self tea franchise. So. Are in the Philippines with edible selfie on milk tea on top. So we started 2017, and um, our franchise system is developed by Sir RK, um, by RK Franchise Consultancy, and we are also a member of Filipino International Franchise Association. Our mission is to provide business opportunities to Filipinos here and abroad, and. Also, um, right now, no, we have this um, advocacy wherein we are um, hiring persons with disabilities to provide jobs for them as well. So, um, going straight to the franchise of self tea, why you should franchise self tea first? Because we are um, because of the uniqueness of our product. Of course, we're first in the Philippines in this concept, and second, of course, is. We have wide array of products, so not only milk tea, blended teas, we also offer food with self tea. And then, of course, the quality and affordability of our product. No? So we focus, when we develop self tea, when we develop um, uh, our menu, we focus on the quality of the product because we believe that um, the, the self tea is just a bonus. So, we focus on the quality to make sure that we will be able to have um, um, returning customers or regular customers. And yeah, and we are also, we also have fast growing markets. So we all know um, the milk tea craze here in the Philippines. So yeah, so I'll show you guys a video of why you should um, franchise self. Thank you. 
So, ayan. So, with self you can also collaborate with your existing businesses. Like, for example, um, we have this collaboration with Lavada and with other brands as well. So, we're very flexible when it comes to that. So, um, ayan. And here's also a video of um, our franchisee. So, let's watch. We franchise the selfie lab because our family loves milky and because of its unique edible selfie on top of the drink, which is the first in the food case. And it gives our customers more of a personalized drink which differentiates us from other milky stores. Prior to the pandemic, we were operating inside of the mall, but because of the pandemic, we had to move out. So we have support from our franchises, and now we are operating in Silangpai. Because of that, we now have higher sales and a more flexible time because we're in a more open area. For aspiring young entrepreneurs who are planning to take up a business, you shouldn't be afraid to take risks. And in considering a brand to franchise, you should be the first to believe in your own products. We are now open for dining, steakhouse, and deliveries. We also offer new flavors from milk taste to food taste and also snacks. For more updates, you can follow our Facebook and Instagram. And for orders, you may contact this number below. See you! Ayan, so they are our franchisee from Silang, no? And um, prior to pandemic, Prior to pandemic, they were operating inside mall. And as part of our support is, of course, we allowed them to relocate. And then now they're located in um, Silang Bayan. So it's much more open area. And because of that, they are um, uh, mas mataas na yung sales nila compared to when they were inside mall. So those are one of our support to our franchises. And then... So, ayan, because na of the uniqueness of our concept, so, um, na-feature na rin tayo with, um, ayan, ASAP from ABS-CBN, and then Philippine Star, Kapuso Mo Jessica So, and other celebrities are also um, eh, uh, inviting us for their events. So, um, these are just few. Um, you can Google us on, and then you'll get to see a lot of write-ups about us and yung mga feedback about um, self. Okay. So like what I said earlier, no, um, yung delivery partners namin, ito yung, these are the uh, reason kung bakit um, we are still here. So even though it's pandemic, these delivery partners are, um, kung baga sila yung nakatulong sa atin. Um, food Panda, Grab Food, and Lala Food. And also for our um, future na franchises, um, these malls are also our partners. So um, if ever that you want to open um, inside this mall, so pwede naman siya because our concept is already approved. Okay? So this is our menu. As you can see, um, we have varieties of um, of um, drinks to choose from. And also, from time to time, naglalabas talaga kami ng mga um, drinks na seasonal. So for example, noong summer, um, naglabas kami ng bagong drink for summer season and then um, for rainy season naglabas and now as preparation for holiday season so maglalabas din kami na for Christmas okay so ayan. so for um, franchise support of course we we support our we support our franchises um, from start hanggang sa day-to-day -day operations na. So, site selection, site selection assistance, training, and field support, continuous product development. So, we have our own R&D department, and then opening assistance, marketing assistance, and product supply. So, we have our own commissary, which is located in Carmona, Cavite. So, um, wala nang magiging problem yung mga, franchi yung mga franchises when it comes to the stocks. So tips on choosing a location, basically everywhere you can put um, selfie. So schools, hospitals, malls, gasoline stations, street, supermarkets, and churches. Actually, um, 
the good thing about mall locations here in the Philippines is it's strategically located in the middle of um, these establishments. So even though na, um, you might be thinking that malls right now are walang pumupunta, so yung mga malls ngayon na open, um, mga pumapasok dun is mga tao with the intention of eating na talaga or with buying. So even though filtered, pero um, kumbaga yung mga pumapasok is um, bumibili talaga. So, ito po yung um, store ng selfie. So, this is for um, stand-alone na selfie. So, for a cafe. Ayan. So, we upgraded it. Actually, this pandemic, so, nag, um, kumbaga nag-rebrand kami. So, we upgraded our branding. And, of course, our menu selection. So, ayan. It's very Instagram-worthy. It's very when you're when you're here, it's like um, you're in a different place, and the ambiance of the store is um, aside from the quality and drinks of drinks that we offer is of course very important. The ambiance of the store inside, so that you'll feel relaxed and you can work or you can um, talk with other people. Yeah. So for our franchise packages, we have two, Cafe Express and Cafe Plus. So the only difference is for Cafe Express, um, medyo mas maliit siya, minimum of 10 square meters. So basically, lahat na rin kasama dyan. It's for uh, Ang hindi na lang kasama is the construction. But we will guide you all the way dun sa construction. So for Cafe Plus, it's just 100,000 difference. Pero mas full yung menu niya. And this, we, it also includes na POS and lahat ng mga equipment. So um, 588,000 for Cafe Plus. And then minimum of 30 square meter. So as I said na earlier, we have new brand which is Self, um, Sam Group Express. So we are offering it also for franchise na two in one. So selfie and Sam Group Express for only eight hundred eighty eight thousand, all included except for the um, construction cost. So yung mga training, yung mga equipment, it's all included. So we just opened our Sam Group Express and selfie in Alabang Town Center. So medyo na highlight lang dito is Sam Group Express, but we are also offering selfie here. So it's located in Alabang Town Center beside Turk Shawarma and Mesa Assistant Steak. So it's in second floor. So if you can visit, you can try. Ayan. So for the application process, basically you submit your LOI and we'll invite you for a meeting. This one you can do Zoom. No? And then signing of memorandum agreement. And then we will visit your location. And then after that, all settled. Um, Pag approve na yung location, franchise agreement, and then store construction and pre opening. Sometimes it will take one to three months, and then staff training, and then there you go, grand opening na ng store mo. So, ayan, you can contact me, you can contact us on this number if you are interested to franchise self tea. Ayan. Okay, thank you. All right. Uh... Thank you so much for your presentation, Ms. Ann. Thank you, and, sir. Uh, and before we uh, go, we still have a few announcements for today. And um, I share my screen for that purpose with you. All right. So uh, if you're interested to get my book all about franchising, uh, you can request it uh, through here or send us a message through Facebook and we send it the link or we send you a copy of it in PDF format. Uh, as the lady said, uh, True Blends and Self D and uh, 800 other companies have been developed by RK Franchise Consultancy. So if you have a company and you want to franchise it out in the Philippines or globally, Get in touch with us at 8912-2946 or 8912-2973 and we prepare everything what you need to be a franchisor from structuring to the operations manual, franchise marketing materials, contracts, everything. You need to be a professional franchisor. 
So actually we developed more than 800 companies already in the Philippines and another 100 outside the Philippines. And outside the Philippines, if you are listening to us from uh, any country, from any of 35 countries in the world, we are doing franchise development through our brand, Fran Mundo. You can take a look at that at franmundo.com. And if you have a company who is engaged in distribution, we have a, a sister company called GoFran. And with GoFran, we do expansion works for distribution company. So we prepare the same as with the franchise, the structure of the distribution system, the marketing materials, the legal aspect, the contracts, the distributor manual, and of course, very important also, territory mapping. And of course, all our RK Franchise Consultancy clients are member of FIFA, Filipino International Franchise Association. Uh, you can also get our services for trademarks. So even if you're not a member, you can still get the trademark through the uh, association. And uh, please read our magazine, franchising.ph magazine. Uh, it, right now we have the September issue, wherein we are featuring uh, chicken franchises. So we have several uh, chicken franchises which are explained in the September issue. Then we are organizing four virtual expos this year. The Cebu Franchise Expo in October 1 to 15 and the Mindanao Franchise Expo. And then in November, the Iloilo and the Palawan Franchise Expo. All of them this year still virtual. So the first one we have is the 22nd Cebu Franchise Expo Virtual Edition. So from October 1 to 15, you can take a look at it at uh, cebufranchise.com. We also have a free franchise and opportunity seminar, and we have uh, feature companies who present there uh, are Mr. Chef, Mr. Donuts, uh, Family Mart, and um, of course, Archie Franchise Consultancy will do a seminar about developing a franchise that will be on October 9 at 2 p.m. on facebook.com, uh, Cebu Franchise. And then after the Cebu Franchise Expo, we have the 16th Mindanao Franchise Expo from October 16 to 30 at MindanaoFranchise.com. Uh, we introduce also to some of our Facebook groups. We have Filipino Franchising. Uh, then we have a Facebook group for the Milk Tea, so Milk Tea Franchise. Uh, please take a look at it. And for our food franchisors and food operators, we have Kain Muna. All right. If you want to see the previous uh, episodes of uh, the Franchise Hour or uh, to see our seminars, please go to YouTube. Our channel is RK Franchise, and you find everything there. So again, thank you to our guests for today, Ms. Joyce Koyu and Ms. Uh, Mary Ann uh, Oliveros, who have been my guests for today. And uh, I, again, again, thanks to the two ladies for being my guests today. And... Uh, I'll see all of you again next Thursday when we have Mr. Donut as guest to present the franchise. All right. Thank you so much, ladies. Thank you, viewers. And see you again next Thursday. Bye-bye.